Hello, Grade 4 students, and welcome to a new lesson. Today's lesson is from Module 9, Project 2. As for the objectives of the lesson, by the end of the lesson, you will be able to write a description about an animal using a fact file. Make sure, students, you open your student books on page 109 and your workbooks on page 113. Let's start today's lesson with a game. You need to guess, who am I? I am going to show you some information related to animals, and you need to guess, what is this animal? Now please read with me. I'm brave. I have sharp teeth. I'm the king of the jungle. I roar. Who am I? Can you guess? It's the lion. Super students. Let's continue. Let's read then guess. I'm white. I eat carrots. I have long ears. I can run fast. Who am I? Give it a try. Try to guess. It's the rabbit. Super. Let's continue reading. I have long hands. I like to swing on the trees. I love bananas. I live in the tree. Who am I? I think this is easy. It's the monkey. Excellent students. Now this is the last one. Read along, then guess. I have large round head, big furry ears, and big black nose. My color is gray-brown with white fur on the chest. Who am I? Try to guess. It's the koala. Excellent students. Now please open your student books on page 109, activity number one. It's time to recall what we took in the previous lesson. As you remember, we read a fact file in the previous lesson about the koala. And a fact file is like a short report of all the most important information on one thing. Then we read a paragraph written by Nora about her favorite animal, and she took the information from the fact file. Now it's time to go over some writing tips whenever you want to write about your favorite animal. Follow with me. Writing tip number one. Choose an animal you want to write about and find information about it. Maybe you'd like to write about the rabbit, monkey, cat, or even the oryx. Writing tip number two. Think of some questions that can help you decide what kind of information to include in your paragraph. Look at these questions. Whenever you want to write about your favorite animal, you would look for where does it live? What does it look like? What does it eat? What does it drink? What's special about it? And why do you like it? Writing tip number three. Use the headings in the fact file to organize your information. And the headings are name of the animal, lives, which means where does it live, what it looks like, a description of the animal, eats, what does it eat, what's special about it, and why do you like it? Now refer to your workbook on page 113, activity number two. It's time to read a fact file about the camel and write about it. Activity number two. Look at the fact file, then write a description. Let's start with the first information. Name of the animal. Arabian camel. We would start with 
Arabian camels. And why are we using the plural here? Because the verb is live. So we say Arabian camels live in. Now let's look for an information that mentions where do Arabian camels live. Over here, the deserts of Africa, Asia, and Australia. So the sentence would be, Arabian camels live in the deserts of Africa, Asia, and Australia. Pay attention to the plural. Now pause the video and complete. Let's continue writing. Look at this, what it looks like. The first sentence is, it is tall. So we say they are tall. Super. Let's move on with the information they have got. Look at this. It's mentioned it has got brown fur. It has got a long neck and a hump on its back. So I would say they have got brown fur. Also, they have got a long neck and a hump on its back. Good job. Now let's move to the next line. Camels eat. Look in the fact file for an information related to what they eat. Eats, leaves, dry grass, and desert plants. So the sentence would be, Camels eat leaves, dry grass, and desert plants. Super! Let's continue. The next line, camels have got. So, read with me. What's special about it? It has got long, strong legs with two toes on each foot. It can travel for days without food or water. It can run very fast. So we would continue the sentence with, Camels have got long, strong legs with two toes on each foot. It can travel for days without food or water. It can run very fast. And the last one. I like camels because... The answer is here. We would say, I like camels because they are very useful to people. Super students great for. Now it's time to ask Ahmed a question. Follow with me. Read the question with me. What is your favorite animal? Listen to Ahmed. My favorite animal is the oryx. And we all know that the oryx is the national animal of Qatar. It's time to help Ahmed write about his favorite animal. Ahmed said that his favorite animal is the oryx. Listen to the information about the oryx. Question number one, where does it live? It lives in the desert in Africa and the Arabian Gulf. Next, what does it look like? It has got four legs and it is covered with white fur and it has got long horns. Let's move on. What does it eat? It eats grass. Next, what does it drink? They don't drink much water. They get water from what they eat. Next, what's special about it? It is very fast. And finally, why do you like it? Ahmed likes it because it is beautiful. 
as you can see on the left side, a fact file about the Oryx. Ahmed gathered all of the information after answering the questions. Let's start helping Ahmed write about his favorite animal. So he would write the title, My Favorite Animal. And he put a picture of the Oryx on the right side. Let's start with the first information. Look at the fact file. Lives. Deserts in Africa, Arabian Gulf. So the first sentence would be, Oryxes live in the desert in Africa and the Arabian Gulf. Good job. We are done with this information. Let's move to the next. What it looks like. Four legs covered with white fur, long horns. The next sentence would be, they have got four legs and they are covered with white fur. We are going to add, also, they have got long horns. Good job. We are done with the first paragraph. Now let's move to the second paragraph. The first information is eats, grass. So the first sentence would be, they eat grass. Super, we are done with this. Now again, refer to the fact file. Drinks, they get water from what they eat, which means they don't drink much water. So I would add, and they don't drink much water. Super, because they get water from what they eat. And we are done with this. Let's move to the next information. What's special about it? Very fast. I would say, also, they are very fast animals. Super. Now it's time for Ahmed to end his writing with the final information from the fact file. It's mentioned, I like it because beautiful. So he would say in the third paragraph, I like oryxes because they are beautiful animals. Super great for students. Make sure when you want to check your writing, you refer to the following checklist. Check your spelling, capitalization, punctuation, grammar, and make sure you write in a nice handwriting. Thank you. See you next time. Bye.